Uh, a date with death. Will you save humanity or will you just give up? Well, some days. Some days. I'm not, it depends on these comments, to be honest. The sweet embrace of death. The death is really hot, though. I chuckled. That's cute. I love it. Death be looking fine. Well, based on these comments, humanity survives today. I'm already going to give it five stars because that's just the man I am. If you make death cute, then we're good. On this date, you will either win or humanity will fall. I am the main protagonist. A date with death? I thought this was an actual dating game. How do I win? Instructions. How to live life. No, thank you. I skip. I skip the intro. Like, if you think about it, as babies, we all skip the intro. Because you can't remember, like, being a, a baby. So you, you skip the intro and everyone else has to live with it. Because they're they're in the unskippable cutscene mode, but you're good. I like this so far. Probably pretty easy. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. No, 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 no. You know, when you're a magician, like in the real world, you only really do need one spell. You can cast fire. Like, okay, you win every argument, every fight. It doesn't matter. Dang. Fairly certain I'm supposed to lose. What's up, Death? You seem to have fallen. The human world will now burn. Unless, question mark, flushed. I can grant another chance. Will you take it? Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, what the heck? Hold on, I don't need Death's stinky help. I'm an independent woman, guy, uh, non-gender specific main character. Don't make it to the gate. You know, this all could have been avoided if you made a moat. I feel like most castles you make a nice moat. You gotta walk the bridge. And on that bridge is me with fireballs. Two, three. I guess I guess you just jump into the moat. Hold on, I'm defeating my own purpose. No. This is why you don't read books, kids. Cause then you the responsibility. Yeah, no way. No way. Date with death. What up, death? You wanna make out? I can grant you another chance. Will you take it? Nah, not this time. I have a thing for skeletons. He blushes. Oh, I get it. You're probably suffering from post-death stress disorder. I better send you back so you get some fresh air. Aw. I got some fresh air. You guys wanna hang out? You guys wanna, you wanna hang out? Hey, I just want a friend. I'm back. Look, I don't know what your goal is. I was informed by the goddess that I should revive you if you were to die. That's all I'm here to do. I enjoy your company. That's besides the point. I'm here to make sure you don't die. You might not be taking it seriously, but there's a there's a war out there. I have a huge backlog of souls I have to deal with. And if I kill monsters, you'll have more work. If I don't succeed, you don't want to know what will happen. What will happen? I wouldn't know because I never had to deal with someone as daft as you. Come on, give me some power ups then, dude. Just go back and save the world. Damn it. Uh Give me hugs. I just want to be hugged. I just want to be felt by somebody. Can I help with your backlog of souls? Yes, you can help by not dying. Oh, man. Give me hugs. You seem to have... Oh, great. It's you again. Sorry, it's hard to kill them all. Well, it is a trial for you to become a hero. Do you think Hercules had to just lay around and become a hero? Don't worry, I can revive. Hercules was a child of a, a god. He was half god. You're comparing me to Hercules. Look at me. Look, look at me. Look at my shape. I'm like half jelly bean. Don't worry, I can revive and you can try again. Oh man, I want to be friends. Why do all my friends hate me? I poke you. 
Oh good, it's you again. Did you miss me? I live in an ethereal realm. Time is no meaning here. But a skill. I didn't ear a no. <laughs> No, I did not miss you. Right now, the only thing you're doing is annoying me. I'm going to give you simple instructions. You know what? He's playing hard to get. He's playing hard to get. You know, he's playing hard to get. Let's do this. Great, you're back. Whoa, you are, you're happy to, that I'm back? Oh, I miss you too. Either way, I have a plan to stop you from constantly dying and me having to revive you. Plan? Yes, quite a genius idea I got. I'm going to give you power that will immediately kill all enemies you touch. What? Oh my god. Death, man. Wait, you again? My love is stronger than the power of the gods? No. Your stupidity is stronger than the power of the gods. I appreciate it. Are you killing yourself on purpose? Mmm, yeah, not gonna lie. Why? If you save the world, you'll be bestowed unimaginable riches. Your own kingdom. You'll be a god among man. What's the point of wealth without love? This is getting deep, dude. And what does killing yourself help in the pursuit of love? Ah. Uh... Well, my love is here. Oh, I get it. Now your loved one must have been killed during the war. Tell me the name and maybe I can re revive them too. <laughs> Their name is Death. <laughs> Who, me? Why does that... Huh? Reviving now, bye. <laughs> He's so kawaii! Sundari Death. Oh. Sight. All right, I thought you were saying all those things because of PTSD. It's PTSD, but PDSD, post-death. Oh, okay, I see, post-death. So let's pretend all you said before never happened, okay? Silence, the silence will smother you. Great, so you seem to have fallen. The human world will now burn. I can grant you another choice, will you take it? No, chance. We nah, no thanks, man. I'm chilling, will you take, nah, bro. Sigh. Okay, since you don't seem to want to go back, I have another plan. Now you will have the power of the life gods. Yeah, I eat you. Death is just, you know, hella kawaii. You know, if you took the effort to kill yourself and did literally anything else, you'd probably be very successful. Even with the power of the gods and the world in your hands. Your first instinct is to throw yourself into enemies hoping they kill you. I would do anything for love, but I won't do that. Which is win the game. And I would do anything for you to do your job. Okay, well go out with me. But worry not. I have a foolproof plan. Foolproof plan. The elixir of Hercules himself. Make your attack stronger than anything else in the world. Great. Oh yeah, they are pretty strong. Oh my god, I could actually win. You guys ever read a manga and you can't like set it down? This is like the best manga like I've ever read. Oh wait, this is just a Goosebumps book. Well, there you have it. How are you still managing to die so quickly? Missed. <laughs> Missed. Fair point, then I'll... Also give you the aura of death. Dude. Look at these things. Look. Ah. They're like my friends. Watch the fire go round and round. Oh, hey, Darren. You want to be part of my book club? There's one spot open. Well, damn. I will give the power of death. Use this spell by pressing the right mouse button. And you will kill everything. Holy shit, for real? Oh my god, it, it works. 
Bruh. Look at oh dude, look, I can shake my little booty. Bana 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 dance party. I can't have any friends because of these fireballs. Bana na 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 dance party. I'm not gonna lie, I wonder what wave seven is. Bum 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 dance party. Bum 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 dance party. Bum 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 bum. Uh oh. Wave seven. Dance party. All my friends showed up for my birthday party, y'all. What's up? I got the candles. They caught they caught the tree on fire, but I still got the candles. Where you guys going? I'm the birthday boy. No. Fine, I give up. I can't really stop you from coming here. Tell me, what do you want to accomplish with this? I want to go on a date. You sundary, kawaii-looking thing. Yeah, what can I, what can I say? I got a thing for tall people. Come on. Just, yeah. You know I'm death itself, a personified force of nature. We can't be together. You don't... You don't until you try it. You don't know until you try it. Fine. But after the date, you're going to save the world. Is that a fact? And like that, the hero and death went on a date. Afterwards, the hero kept his word and saved the world. A feat that would have been much more impressive if not the, the absolute power the hero had. After he saved the world, the people cheered, and the hero simply smiled back and ran away. He immediately threw himself off a cliff and spent the rest of eternity by death's side. That's kind of epic. Alright, let's see if we can beat this. I won, but at what cost? At what cost? And with that, the war was won. The hero had all the odds stacked against him, but he still managed to be victorious in the end. He was forever remembered by... The amazing he really was. He, however, could only think of the time he would meet death once again. Oh, I'm crying. It wasn't worth it. It wasn't worth it. <laughs> no. I ruined true love. Why would I do that? Oh, oh my god. Interactive ball guy. <laughs> Newgrounds podcast. <laughs>